Hi, my name is Joshua Ornstein. I'm the technical product lead for QCBot, a robot that we are developing here at Vecna Technologies. This is Diane. This is one of our QCBots. Uh, QCBot is developed to do three uh, uh, interesting and innovative things in hospitals and medical centers. The first is to autonomously deliver materials throughout the hospital. Those materials could be medication, linen, uh, food, removing those ro remote rote tasks from the people who have to do them daily. On top of that, it also provides uh, video chat abilities, so nurses can talk with providers and physicians and pharmacists uh, remotely when they're at the bedside of the patient. And on top of that, it adds on a user interface which provides very easy um, and intuitive instructions for not only clinical self-service, uh, but also patient self-service. Um, for example, a patient can check into their appointments at a QCBot and it can then lead them to where their appointment is. The primary purpose of QCBot is to have it do a lot of the simple time-consuming tasks that uh, nurses and physicians have to deal with on a day-to-day -day basis, giving them the more time to spend with the patients, more time to care for people, and, and giving them that personal one-on-one -on -one attention that provides better care. The technology is innovative and new. It's something that's only being introduced into hospitals in the past few years and uh, automated vehicles is something that you might have heard about in you know, sci-fi or in you know, new upcoming stuff that's being done in, at universities, um, but the robot that we are developing here is something that is going to be introduced to hospitals and one day you will see when you go to the hospital bringing your medicine or your food to you. The goal here is to make a system that is user-friendly, is safe, and it's something that everyone feels like is part of the environment, is part of the doctors and nurses and people providing you and your family health and, uh, and wellness.